game contains mature subject matter and might still be Suda's best title. <laughs> uh, we are playing the brand new Steam version of the greatest title sequence, or a really good one at least, of Killer7. Uh, this just came out a few days ago, and um, really wanted to check it out, uh, see what type of support it has on the PC. That's that's such a good title screen. Let's press start. Clicking, clicking on the mouse. So we have mouse support, which is which is neat. Uh, this is put out by NIS America, or you know they help publish it, whatever. I still don't understand the details of this. Why why Capcom was just able to let this happen like they signed off on it obviously uh but beyond that i'm like i, I don't know cool we get killer seven on steam that's neat and random uh it's been a couple of years since i played this so i'm gonna give it an honest go again and depending on how it goes and depending on how you guys feel i i've always kind of wanted to do an lp of this game i've never actually beaten killer seven on the gamecube i got really far into the second disc and i had to return it because i had like almost no money back then and i i was just renting the game and you know after two or three rentals i was like okay well I, other games are coming out and i just never got around to it unfortunately i am a fake fan let's new game it up <laughs> this is cool that damn fuck you <laughs> i don't understand what this part means uh wow it's it's weird that killer sound is a game like me and a lot of people at the time should have been like, I don't, I don't like this. It's so weird, but it's so weird, and that's why a lot of people gravitated it. Uh, back in the day, what this came out in like what 2004, 2005? I missed the uh, opening title that kind of said the dates on there. Garcia and Smith, and nothing looked like this back then, and nothing still looks like this exactly like this. Uh, to this day, I find these backgrounds, maybe there's some obscure indie game that, that kind of does it, but the shading on buildings and such, especially in these cinemas, is is so unique to Killer7. Like, Suda didn't even get really close to how this looks. Like, No More Heroes does look a little bit different aesthetically to me. Um, even Killer7, not Killer7, what's the other one? The other one everyone forgets. Um, Killer is Dead. Uh, which, you know, Killer is Dead is, is kind of fun, but it still doesn't really hold a candle, I think, aesthetically or, like, character or, like, story-wise. As weird as the story is, the concept is just, a l like... Me. So you're there yet? You mean this shit all? That's where they all hang out. Our information tells us that there's 14 of them. And they're all fun. Nah, I keep one alive so we can ask where the boss is. Anything else I should know? Nah, not really. You'll know when you see them, they're, uh, different. Will do. Well, may the Lord smile. And the devil have mercy. <laughs> uh, I believe Chris Zimmerman Salter uh, did the voice acting directing on that. And that's a name I've mentioned several times. Uh, did all the, the voice uh, directing for all the Metal Gear games. So there's a lot of Metal Gear voice actors kind of thrown in this. That was, I forget the actor's name, but the guy that plays Stillman in MGS2 and, and tons of other roles. Do you wish to learn the controls? No, I think we're good. It's pretty simple. I'm just kind of interested to see how it works on the PC, really. It's time to switch personalities. There is a Killer7 comic book. I think there was like a pre-order bonus. I never read it. I really should. <laughs> go any further it's dangerous my friends are all dead they were all murdered by people that look like this i have been chosen oh no as i have a smile you're fucked oh shit there's more than 14 it's all as good old danny boy breathing dan smith Bastards are breeding. I mean, you could expect this to look nice, and it does. Doesn't seem like there's any enhancements yet. I mean, that looks about as good as it could. 
Earworm was earworm. Yeah, well, it, it's tight. It's Iwazaru. Okay, for those that don't know this game, Iwazaru is kind of like your hint man. Vincel Dil Boris, the seventh Iwazarukov at your service, or just call me Iwazaru for short. Um, this is probably the weirdest way you could possibly doll out tutorial and information, but that's the pseudo way. Um, yeah, yeah, I played the GameCube version of this, obviously, back in the day, because I was a stalwart GameCube warrior. I was a GameCube's the best. Even I knew I was lying to myself, <laughs> and the PS2 is so much better. Um, and I got a PS2, like, I don't know, like, the end of 2004. But I never played the PS2 version of this. I heard it's bad. I heard it's straight up bad. Like, it has shit load times, and it doesn't look as good, and, and frame rate was also an issue, maybe. I'm not sure. Let's talk to Samantha. So I'm trying to remember how her save shit worked. Ah, it's still slot A and slot B. And change that shit, but that's fine. I'm sure it works. Yeah. See, nice, nice and savey. Um, sometimes you can save with Samantha, and it's like they just have like rooms like this where you just can't save. Uh, but they still have the save mechanic here. You just can't use it because Samantha's not having it. She's just super not into you. And she's like, no, no, I won't let you save. And you're like, oh. We got some thick blood. We have zero, though. You don't have any blood. So this is our weird level up and character select screen. Again, for those that don't know. Kaeda. No, Kaid. Kayed is a different thing. It's Kevin Smith. He's doing really well. He lost a lot of weight recently. I like Coyote a lot. And I like Con Smith, actually. And of course, I like the Master Smith. Can I bring him back? What did it say there? I'm not sure if I can bring him back yet. I think I need blood. Select person. Nah, he's, I think I need him later. Need him later. All right, let's just back out. All right, hallway. Let's let's do it. It's quite scary. Elevator hall, I believe, is where where the enemies, where the heaven smiles are smiling. I'm scared. Uh. Where's the blood? I got the blood. I got the power. Sucked to Rosario again. It's a very tight spot, so tight. Let me make a suggestion. You must turn back. What? No, I gotta fight. This is the enemy's den, though. Shudder to think. Their bodies are lined with bombs. Damn. They'll bomb rush you, literally. <laughs> Eliminate them before they blow, but also run away. In the name of Harmon, why am I dressed like this? That's fine, I'm Iwazaru. So again, some nice thick blood. I like that, it's tasty, tasty blood. Yeah, it's a little unnerving to to only see behind you as you move forward on a rail. You don't know what's coming up. Hey, Travis, touchdown, what's up? I like how they actually recorded the, this dialogue, but it's so distorted, but you can't hear the actual words through it. Travis, as far as I can understand it, he might have been a previous Killer7 or another assassin, and he just he just kind of goads you on and or, or sort of insults you a little bit. He doesn't really seem to have a purpose other than that. Here's your Rosara again! Oh, this is a famous screenshot. I saw this. Like, when I used to go to IGN.com on the GameCube section, I saw the screenshot, I'm like, this is the craziest game ever! What the fuck is that pajama boy in the back? Who the hell is this guy? I was, I was enthralled. Uh, so he's talking about soul bullets. 
uh, which I, I think are just really uh, powerful ammunition you can get, or you buy you buy the bullets. Again, it's been a little while. That's fine, Irizar. You're trying hard. Okay, the parking garage. It's Camilla Smile. Uh. Okay, hello. <laughs> this is weird. Alright, I want to kill this over here. This is like a weird enemy generator. I got that thick blood though. Oh shit! I thought he, I assumed he was dead. God, this game is so weird and cool. <laughs> anyway, uh, let's go over here. Let me talk to some Travis. I think I said this in a previous video about this game, but like, it's no coincidence that it says "bad girl." On the sh on the on the T-shirt of a character named Travis in a Suda Fifty One game, he just likes reusing these types of things. Yeah, I think it's my job to eradicate Heaven Smile. The game doesn't really have a lot of explanation at the very start. But basically, the world is overrun with uh, a bunch of assassins and bombs and shit going off. The uh, the world's a little messed up. I think we get an intro later, maybe after this part of the game I kind of forget get that bullet so that's a soul sh soul shell I might need that for later um, and heaven smile is the super evil uh, terrorist organization and I'm part of the killer seven or I'm one of the split personalities of Harmon who fights the leader of the heaven smile Quan Lo I forget Kuan Lo, I, I forget the name of the uh, the main antagonist, but that's the guy we gotta get. Let's go the stairs. See what's on low floor. Ah, oh, this music. Killer Seven also famous for a really good soundtrack. Um, the Steam version of this is actually the, there. It comes in a bundle that has a digital art book and the full soundtrack. That's a good fucking deal. It was our. Do you, th do you agree that's a good deal? It is a tight deal. An ultra tight deal. <laughs> Life is precious. And the enemies mean business. No, I know what they're called, dude. There really isn't. Thanks, Iwazaru. That was weird. I don't remember that. <laughs> Man, all these hoodie kids. <laughs> okay, that went well. Lost. Oh shit! Bloody hell, how'd I miss that? Damn! Harmon's room, Harmon's room. So, so yeah. So yeah, Samantha's wearing all cash, so I'm not allowed to save here. <laughs> she doesn't want to save for me. Create serum from blood by pressing the A button. Yeah, thick blood, creating the serum. Yeah. You don't have enough blood, so there's that. <laughs> uh, so the, uh, the the thick blood, uh, the big red globules that I get from hitting the weak points, um, uh, I, that can be exchanged for serums, and serums are just like little level ups for your individual stats here, like power, speed, waver, t 
target locked, and crits. Okay, I'm gonna switch to Coyote, I think. Uh, just because uh, I took a hit there, and I'm, got, I'm just kind of worried I don't want to lose any characters right now. Um, for those that don't know anything about Killer7, uh, when you do... Um, it's not a roguelike, per se, but you can't get a character killed. I hate micro smiles, they're weird. Okay. And he holds his gun all super cool. Okay. And you can see they even have different run speeds, the characters. Coyote is a coyote, so he's fast Odie. You gotta help me. Oh, Jesus! Yun Hyun. Gold times, yes, you tell me. How's old Smith? Things going good with Mills, no? That old Smith, not much of a successor. But good man, yes. Thank you, much gratitude. So, I assume this guy is another ghost. Ghost of killers past. Ready for today's hint? Sure. I checked the candlesticks. A strange decision indeed. It is hidden here. The order is hidden here. You want to know more? Then use this mask. Shoot the mask and the mask will tell you. But watch out, the mask lusts for blood. But he's, he's a chomper though, even thicker blood. Demons lust for blood, yes, this is the blood of a demon mask I found. If you are brave, shoot the mask. It'll tell you everything. That's weird. Oh god, there's nothing there. Good. I was just searching there's a monster. Oh god, Macaulay Culkin! Sounds like you got bomb mode, my friend. Please help. I can't see a thing. Okay, let's go up the stairs. Hey, we're on the rough. Oh god, those hours just fucking scared me. Master. We're in a very tight spot, as you can see. It's such a tight spot, I can't even. He's here. Yes. Him. You can't. You're going to go and kill him. Oh no. What? Impossible. You're a fool. An incorrigible fool. Impossible. You will fail. Jeez. You know nothing of a strength. Oh, stupid, stupid master. That Mills really fooled you. In the name of the fool. Okay. Fortunately, the sections that kind of like work like this that are a little side scrolling or whatever, there's a couple of camera cutaways like that. I don't think enemies ever really appear, but I'm probably wrong. Let's go down this hallway. Carrier pigeon! I love how shitty that pigeon looks. Dear Amir, it is, it is a pleasure to make your acquaintance, and many thanks for choosing me for the job. My name is Johnny Gang Gagnon. Otherwise known as Speedster. Thank you, Bianca the Pigeon. I get excited when I slit a guy's throat. I know that may be sick, but I do the best work in town. This is a report on the job. I'm sure you'll like what I have to say. I watch them like a hawk, so I think half the reward is in order. There are seven in the Smith Syndicate. Dan Smith uses a large caliber revolver. Kaed Smith, who uses a large automatic rifle. Con Smith uses two full auto pistols. Master Smith uses grenades. Kevin Smith, who makes movies. Coyote Smith, who uses a modified gun. Garcia Smith uses a small pistol. They are armed force that rivals a small army. You wouldn't want to be on their bad side. In conclusion, it is the interest of the United States to keep them around. There's no telling when they might come in handy. I'll be contacting you again, Johnny Gang. No. Thanks, Bianca. I love my little walk. Look at him. 
It's, uh, I, can't, I can't get out. I want to get out. All right, let's go this way. Oh, God. I was kind of fucked there. It was going to happen eventually, sadly. Man, that's scary. So, so unfortunately... I'm a cleaner. Uh, yeah, Coyote's dead, but I got Garcian here. And again, for those that, that don't know, um, Garcian kind of becomes this dude that has to pick up the corpse. Pick up your souls, or your blood echoes, as it were. Oh, I, I didn't see Travis over here. I should probably talk to him. Let's talk serious for a second. Haven't smiled? They're holy warriors. Shit, ain't that pretty wicked. <laughs> Warriors who fight with a holy will on their side and use death as a weapon. Their target, the very dignity of the country itself. But why should you understand the meaning? Shit, you're a killer after all. What I want to do right now is head back up to where uh, Coyote died and uh, regain his corpse. Alright, so his body's somewhere here. Right there, it's this bag. But the enemies are there too. So I might just grab his corpse and just run. <laughs> Ew, that's nasty. Look, I'm a cleaner. I can feel so yeah, just like the personality. To me, it's merely cold, rotting flesh. Resurrection! Give it life! Oh shit, it's hard to do this on a mouse. Listen to that No More Heroes shit. I want to take him now. <laughs> Even if it's not a great idea. Yeah, Master Smith! Fuck yes. Alright. So, to handle those heaven smiles in there, I think I want to take out the lead guy and then run away, because there's two that are in the back. Um, but I, th I need more, like, space or room or some shit. Oh my god. Well... Okay, those guys aren't there. That's weird. Oh, you need your honeys here. Old Smith. But I'm the new Mask Smith. I saw information. But it's not so simple. No. I checked the toilet. Okay. <laughs> it fills the water. <laughs> and goes well with the sprinkler. Okay. Uh, how can I make it spray? <laughs> Shoot the mask to hear more. Okay, so I think you actually have to give blood to him to get hints for uh, uh, puzzles and stuff. Harmon's room? Let's go to Harmon's room. I think I need it. Hey, I'm allowed to save now. Thank you, Samantha. <laughs> Alright, Danny now. Okay. This is that room that Travis was looking in before. I'm gonna see what an object is. <laughs> it's a broken pipe! And uh, let's check the dryer, see if anything interesting is going on here. Let's turn this off. Okay. Oh yes, I forgot. This is everyone's favorite waifu in Killer7. <laughs> it's not a day to hang out of the laundry. Great day to use a dryer though. But 
you know, I just love this one. I'll never let anybody have it. You know why? Well, you should. I love to stay inside. You left us behind, didn't you? Fire ring returned. So, girl, you had that ring in your mouth while in the dryer. I needed it all last week. If you finish your business, could you hurry up and leave? You're very much in the way. I am not. Assassins should have better manners. They... Okay. Bye. So yeah, again, for anybody that hasn't really played Killer7, you can kind of already see how it goes. Uh, you're kind of stuck in these, you know, fairly large maps, and there's a lot of um, uh, backtracking. But because you move so swiftly and the game is basically on rails, it's not that bad. It's too easy. Alright, let's try to remove two, one, two. I, but I have the fire ring. I have it though. What the hell? Was this in the GameCube original? I can just switch my members at any time by pressing the number keys? That's awesome! Kaed? You just have to know which, which number is which. So I guess Dan is number one. Yeah, okay. So items... and uh, rings, fire ring. Yeah! Now I can do it. Firing howls with fire! So I'm gonna assume one, two, three, four, five. Yay! Wow, wow. Shelves. And a weird engraving. An old engraving, okay. So I think if I recall I need the two en I need two engravings. Um I have one. I think I get the other one in the bathroom, maybe. Uh, I forget where the bathroom is, but I'll find it. I'll find it. <laughs> oh shit! Yes. Yes. Downward fucking dog. I shouldn't have to do that. Uh, meaning, um, I'm pretty sure that's the restroom. There you go. Uh, pretty sure that I there's never a heaven smile around unless I am um, firing house. Unless the heaven smiles do that. Uh, Mark Hamill laugh. I should be good. Okay, there's that now. Toilet. Turn on toilet and get. Oh wait, no! It flushes downstairs into that broken pipe. Yeah. Okay, into the laundry room, and that's the other thing I need. It's kind of neat the way the the levels are are sort of put together. It makes you feel like they're just kind of one giant puzzle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Obtain odd engraving. Okay, okay. So, let's, we're gonna go back to the library. Already saved, so I think I'm good. This hallway and control panel. Let's do that. Yeah, no! Okay, so it wasn't what I thought. I thought you had to jump over that shit. As like this. Uh oh. <laughs> oh fuck. So now I have double tap on, so I'm pretty... <laughs> yeah, that was a decent shot. Hallway. Hallway, hallway, warehouse. Uh, warehouse? Okay, okay. 
Uh, uh. Yes! I knew Master Smith did that shit. You're fucked. <laughs> Got that yellow blue. Okay, the, the world is opening up. There's there's a Travis. I'll speak to a Travis. I was the chief's first catch. I can still remember. The chief's quivering hand. Like, is he talking about Harmon? The pain went straight up my spine and then back down again. To be honest, that shit felt good. It all happened on that smoldering hot night. Okay. Second carrier pigeon. You're inside a building? That's okay. Pigeons can get inside buildings too. Dear Amir, Amir, we have a big problem. A terrible thing has happened. I can hardly believe it. But the money is not in my account. I don't get it, says Pussy the Pigeon. I need your help. You got my last message, didn't you? I trusted you. Now don't let me down. Promise me. Don't you swerve me. Wire me the money immediately. 125 bucks is peanuts. I'm telling you. This Smith Syndicate operates in strange ways. Guardsian manages the other six personas and mainly acts as a negotiator for work requests. Garcia never uh, eliminates people himself. His role is to retrieve the bodies. Even if another persona is killed, it appears he's able to bring back to life. Like a wizard. And so fucking wizard did it. However, it's my hunch that somebody off stage is calling the shots and controlling Garcia. And there must be a hidden mastermind separate from the active team. And it's likely that his mastermind assigns the jobs. Garcia is very loyal and he values the organization. He controls the personas to keep the organization safe. He's a middle manager, you see. I'm a cleaner. The members switch using the medium of television or just pressing the keys on the keyboard. The Smith Syndicate is composed of one sensible person and six freaks. I have never seen the personas interact with each other. Soon I expect to unmask the myth behind this strange group. I'll be contacting you again, Johnny Gagnon. Uh, let's go back to... Dan, that's really hey. Like, am I stupid? Could you do that in the GameCube original? Because I always thought you had to switch in the other thing. Like, was I a stupid babby child? Here is our once more master. Very tight. Like, tighter than tight. The tightiest! Oh, I have offered my master... I have offended my master with foul words, but please, you must understand. Just thinking about him drives me absolutely bonk shit. He, fi he fixes to sink, and so he sends his unending parade of minions with no signs of lighting up. Just how many followers does he command? It's crazy. He has over a million followers on Twitter alone. Don't even think about IG. Yeah, Khan's cool. Yeah. He runs like Naruto. Like that. <laughs> uh, okay, let's go over here. Fourth floor. Get Watch out! <laughs> oh no! Oh. <laughs> Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Good shots, good shots. Let's go down this hallway, see what's up. Uh, Irizaru and the weird pajama man is back there. I don't understand. We're in a tight spot. Watch out for barefoot. Kaid. I've sensed this presence before. My ex-wife Mizaru is near. <laughs> what? She is now the servant of Barefoot. Because Kaid doesn't wear shoes, so that must be... Let my wife serve you through Barefoot. Use the Y button for DEATH SHOWER! In the name of Harmon. 
Is that here? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, so, two. For Kaid. There you go, it's Q. Oh, fuck. Okay, so that's Iwazaru's wife, and like, she points to that stuff. Barrier destroyed. Kaid is neat. I think I drew some fan art of her back in the day. Some bullets. More soul shells. Cool. Uh, let's go back to Ma uh, Dan. Yeah, you know what? No, I, I just was making a point of being, um, con. Five. Okay, he's five. It would be fun to remember those. He's so fast! Let's try this broken hallway. I didn't have an obvious weakness. Just, just be masked straight out, cause like, look at that. Bam, bam. Oh, I'm really getting into this shit. Be able to switch like that's awesome. Oh. Uh, uh, come on, yeah, right guy. Excellent. There's another Travis. L.A. L.A. Uh, uh, you're making some ghost eggs? Real out of mind your manners. You sound like you said waifu. You guys are just a pack of losers. <laughs> you don't even know how to make use of your abilities. I just may had abilities. There are traitors in heaven, smile. The chief's very own inside guys. Huh. They have a white body splattered with red blood. Our minor traitorous deeds. Funny thing, the splotches look like beautiful red roses. Okay. If you find Camilla Smile, I mean, we killed one before, use your ability. Kill one of them and you'll get loaded up for real, man. Okay. Hallway. Nobody here. Okay. I was, again, a little paranoid. The boiler room and just have a nice old boiler match. Okay. No. No. So I kind of actually do remember this. There's a wall you can splash blood on with uh, Kaid. Uh, and I believe it says no. So let's see if that's actually right. Yeah! Quick input. Lock deactivated. Hey Travis, which what's what's up? Hey, what's 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 up? Revi it's sexual, yeah. It's different than a duplicate. It's an in evolved heaven smile. They use some type of sunstone on it with boosted power. You gotta take it out before it gets too close. You mean like all heaven smiles? They're crazy. Uh, they'll be on top of you the moment you open that damn door. Okay, good to know. Oh, the Rosaru, Jesus. Master, we're in a tight spot. Things are turning in a bad way. I think they're going okay. Don't be like fucking Negatron. An infamous criminal. And he's protecting him. Wicked bad partners. Indeed, indeed. Ah, yes. Seek out the soul shells. With soul shells. He'll sure, are you sure to allow you through the gates in the name of Harmon? Yeah, I need the soul shells to pay off a guy to let me in. Fortunately, I have like two. Yeah, this guy, I forgot all about this. The gatekeeper. He also looks a little like Travis. Next, please. Where to? To the Vinculum gate. Let me take those. Yes, all received. Yeah! Go right on inside. Boom. 
Yeah! God, about this fucking track. Oh, that's baby making music right there. Coliseum, let's do it. Oh yeah, and, bet and before a boss fight, you switch to uh, switch to another character. But let's 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 talk it over with Azaru, Master. Listen, it's very tight. Have you heard about how tight it is? Ain't even funny. Once you open the door, there's no turning back, Master. Well, you can come back, but I mean that's the gravity of the whole thing. It's what is happening? Don't get me wrong. Like a prelude to ladder battles, you see. You must take it very seriously. In the name of Harmon. This area is cool. I don't know what it is. I like it. Let's just leave, though. Ah, oh, this one again. Please help me. This monster is quick as lightning. I tried my best to run away. Is this is Jackie Bryant? But it caught up. Hurry. Kill it before it explodes. <laughs> Kill it before it explodes. I'm going to die again. Somebody please help. Ghosts are super real. Ven Venculum Gate. Let's do it. Speed smile. Holy shit. Scary. Okay, well, I was a little scared there, but now I'm not. All this steam, though, sounds really loud, and I'm afraid, like, I can't hear it when I haven't smile. Smiles. Laughs. Whatever. Express elevator going down or up. Up, it seems. Security cameras always play some sort of a weird role. I'll be Garcian, why not? Yes, Travis? What is it? Sexual pillow talk, bad girl. Don't be shy. Who would have figured you'd be the only survivor? Well, anyway, are you getting along with the chief? Straight up, I was waiting for you. Yeah, I know. Don't be so mad, man. Don't glare at me like that. The chief will wake up. Really? I'm sorry. The other chief must be rolling on the floor with laughter. Okay, thank you, Travis, for that powerful, powerful insight. Jesus, kid. Now I remember, I stole the wings. And then... A woman glared at me with a stern look. But I didn't run away. Then I saw it. On the woman's back. Yeah, this is giving hints about the boss. Were faces. They were smiling. Hehe. <laughs> Funny faces. But you better erase the faces. Large hall. There we are, Harmon Smith. And Samantha's is here to give us a nice little push. Something threatening about an old sit button. <laughs> Something threatening about an old man with a rocket launcher. Peace. I'm the mother of this sacred place. Alright, so our first mission is to kill anime. They didn't die in vain. But our other nine children were killed by you. What do you want from us? Is it so bad that we have a purpose in life? We are only serving our gods. At heaven's command, we will kill the unwanted. We must get rid of bad trees from their roots. I hope you are not one of them. Good night, child. 
It's past your bedtime. Oh shit. Fuck you. <laughs> Time to unangel you. you. So I think we have to run. Better think again. <laughs> yeah, 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 I have to run behind her and shoot her. And Dan is a good guy to do it for. Yes. Not the most exciting thing in the world, honestly. She's like, are you just gonna stand in circles all day? And he's like, pretty much. Okay, no, I have to, I have to wait. I have to wait for it to shoot out. Okay. I remember this being way cooler as a kid, I don't know. So I have one more on our other side. I think I'm gonna go this way. No way. Uh. <laughs> Amazing. Ah, uh, I thought I could get it. Well, I did. And, and that's, that's Angel, I guess. Was it this way to leave? Let me check my map. I don't want to be, oh, okay. I guess I can't check my map. So, so that was the boss. Let's go back into large hall. So I thought it'd be a lot harder to kill anime, but I guess not. I can't go further. Oh shit. Fuck you. So that's that's the guy pulling his strings. I guess my trick didn't work on you. Tricks are for kids, Coon. I'm an old Coon. Coon Lan, that was it. I was calling him Quan Lone before. Nothing has changed for thirty years. No matter how many times you try, the result will be the same. Ah, uh, yes. Like our chess games, you always seem to win. I'm not sure about that voice. You tell me. Because you're a bad player. <laughs> a new generation of children will bring order to this age. You're a good friend. But unfortunately, our interest is not mutual. We both have become burdened with so much, and we don't have time for fun anymore. No, huh. there's always time for fun. It's Friday night. <laughs> Let's dance. Whoa! Uh, that's why Suda's been saying let's dance a bunch. That's a powerful bullet. You're awake from your dream. Harmon, the size of the world has changed. It's changed to the size where you can control it with your hands, just like a PDA. The world will keep getting smaller. <laughs>
Angel complete. Oh god, it's so Suda. I mean, yes, this is this is this is his magnum opus, basically. How many they said there were 14. How many did I kill? 20, 30, 40, 52. I'm surprised it's not 51. The day Lin and laughter disappears from the world draws near. Uh Continue to Sunset, which is the next assassination mission. So, I think that was a pretty good look at this brand new version of Killer7 uh, that just got released on Steam. It's really, really good so far. I've, I see, saw no real issues. The frame rate was good. Everything just seemed to work, and I like those hotkeys uh, for everything. For and Again, that's, that's what I think is new in this port. Um, but I'm also going to give you guys watching an opportunity to get a code for this game. Um, I have an extra one to give off. So um, if you can email me at mattmcmuscles at gmail.com uh, with your funniest anything about Killer7. Uh, a joke, meme, image, fan art, uh, whatever you like. A limerick even. Uh, the one that makes me laugh the most or gives a wry smile. Um... I'll send the code back to them. Um, and uh, yeah, go check this game out on Steam if you've never been able to play it before. Um, it's only $20, I believe. And I think that's it's a certain percentage off and it comes bundled with the soundtrack and uh, are an art book. It's it's a pretty good deal. And hopefully if this version does well, uh, Suda has said that um, that'll open doors for console ports as well. So be on the lookout for that, hopefully. So yeah, Killer7, still weird, still holds up, still great. In the name of Harmon.